sponsors for junior rugby tend to throw up the same usual suspects with a local building firm or skip higher business tending to front up the cash to appear on the youngsters' kit. But what about being sponsored by two current England internationals seems far-fetched to say the least but that is the reality for Pontypool and district schools RFU after Saracen's teammates and brothers Billy and Mac of Uni Piola offered their financial support. The duo have given £1,000 of new kit as a debt of gratitude to the man who introduced them to rugby, retired headmaster and ex-avatillery prop Dawson Jones. Jones, who signed their dad FEAO for Pontypool in 1998, told the rugby paper how the England internationals had insisted on the gesture, calling it payback time. He said we were talking to a prospective sponsor who was willing to pay £1,000 provided they could get a photo of the three local Pontypool boys what all been picked for the Lions Billy, Mako and Tau Loop Falatau. Billy of Unipolar and Mako of Unipolar celebrate after Saracen's Champions Cup victory over Clermont Dovin I rang Billy for a chat. He didn't have the time to do the photo but then he said he'll sponsor you. And I said pardon. He said yes, he'll do it £1,000. Send me your bank details and the money will be in your account in 48 hours. The money came through two days later. And when I called to thank him, he said no, thank you Uncle Dawes. This is payback time. That's Billy and Mako for you, typical of the whole family's generosity. They didn't do this to get any publicity. It's a terrific gesture and a great help and I think it's only right that people should know about it. With the money double what they received from the Welsh Rugby Union, the Pontypools schools have bought waterproof coats for the 36-strong under-11 squad, which includes the Vunipolo's cousin James Talamir. The coats feature both the Tongan and Welsh flag, as well as the message supported by the Vunipolo boys. Billy Vunipolo and Harry Robinson as youngsters in Wales Tau Loop Falatau back row, centre left with Mako Vunipolo back row, right and Billy Vunipolo back row, left in the East Wales schools under 11s in 2002. The Vunipolo brothers have been vocal in their admiration for Jones, with Billy writing in his recent autobiography he played a hugely significant role in my life, making me and my family so welcome. The number 8 also penned a letter to his mentor revealing how he would never play for England. Of course, he did go on to break the promise and wear the red rose, with the issue still a frustrating one for Jones. I've still got Billy's letter and every time I speak to Mako the accent is still unmistakably Gwent. Wales had their opportunity but someone blew it.